Surf, Wall, and Minuteman beaches at Vandenberg Air Force Base are back open tonight after 72 hours shutdown. Two shark attacks last week prompted those closures. News Channel 3's Natalie Tavidian spoke with beachgoers today about getting back in the water. Right here. Look at that. On Friday, a group of kayakers say a great white shark attacked them just north of the Vandenberg Air Force Base boathouse. Those are holes from a great white shark. We saw a shark get three quarters of its body out of the water and take a bite into one kayak, throwing one of the kayakers into the air. The shark then took another bite off the kayak. Even after all this, nobody was hurt. Several local beaches were shut down for 72 hours as a precaution. We finally just had it open because of the snowy plover. Much of Surf Beach has been closed through the summer to protect the snowy plover. October 1st was the first day to be out, so I came out actually the Thursday. But on Thursday, reports of a shark attack at Jack's Beach shut down nearby beaches. The 28-year-old victim suffered fine I'll avoid it. Knowing that a shark was so close to local beaches, people say they probably won't dip their toes in too deep into these waters. I just get out and dip halfway. The Shark Research Committee says sharks and their interactions with humans are notoriously difficult to study, but say attacks along the Pacific coast are rare. At Surf Beach, Natalie Tavidian, KCOY 12 Central Coast News.